When was the last time you walked into a bookstore? If you haven't been to a bookstore in a while, and if you're curious, there's actually a lot of cool items. Today, I'm going to show you what I see at Barnes & Noble. So Barnes & Noble is actually very dog friendly, as long as your dog is well behaved. That is why it is so awesome to be able to take Noodle with me. But make sure you ask your manager at your local store. So what's cool about Barnes & Noble is not only they have books, of course, it's a bookstore, but they actually have a lot of pop figures. They have a lot of board games that I love looking at. There's a lot of cool toys that you can get your kids. There's a lot of pop culture items as well as little knickknacks of things that become a sweet find. Nudo and I actually go to Barnes & Noble a lot and we've been to many stores and haven't really had an issue. Here's the video game book section. Look, there's Sonic, Halo, some Star Wars books, and even Overwatch. We really enjoy coming to this location in Hillsdales, California. We come here quite a lot. It's very playful and I enjoy seeing the artwork on the wall. It gets you in the mood for reading. Here's their Dr. Seuss collection. There's the cat in the hat, and Horton here who is very fun. There's the history section, also some science and nature. There's even this one, a history on what is Nintendo. On the front cover, there's Mario holding a Game Boy. And here's what the back looks like. And if you're curious, the book is $5.99. Oh, there's even a Lego one too. If you're a collector of pop figures, Barnes & Noble have quite a good amount of pops too around the whole store. Here's one of their section. Let's see what we can find. Looks like there's Stan Lee, there's Grogu, there's a Jurassic Park character, there's even King the Conqueror. Players from the Good Game, even the Simpsons down there. Over on the side, there is Tommy Pickles from the Rugrats. Here's a notebook and some puzzles from Kiki's Delivery Service. Ooh, let's take a look at the board game section. Let's see what they have. They have Jumanji, Haunted Mansion, even a Goofy movie board game. I've never seen that before. Various clues. At this angle, you can see all the various Monopoly games. Animal Crossing Monopoly game is actually fun. It's very different than the traditional Monopoly game. You go around and explore the island and collect resources. Just like the video game, you collect fossils, apples, butterflies, and fish. And you trade them for bells. And then you take those bells and then you go shopping at Nook's Cranny Shop. Once the player collected all the decoration, the game ends, and whoever has the most Nook Mile wins. If you enjoy wholesome games, and maybe you don't want to argue with your friends and family over a Monopoly night, then this game might be worth a try. Moving on to the board game mystery section. It looks like the escape room also has a board game too. There's various Catan board game over here. I also see Big Thunder Mountain as a board game and Tokyo, King of Tokyo is actually fun as well. Here's some more traditional family games such as Scrabble, Scattergory, and the Logo game. These games are for 4 plus. If you want to hear more about these games, I talked about it more when I went shopping at Target. I'll place the link at the top right of this video. Ooh, I see an owl over there. Where are these owls from again? I can't think of it right now. Here's their puzzle collection. Some Barnes & Noble have a lot more puzzle. Ooh, I love these. I used to see it in Asia all the time. They're very cute. Hi, Noodle. Let me show you the Lego wall they have here. A giant piranha plant from the Super Mario series for Lego. There's also some Minecraft Legos. And over here, there's the city. There's a bulldozer. Hey, what's Monopoly doing over here? There's an RV, a camping set. And there's Frozen, Disney Princesses, but our Star Wars collection. There's a lot of Legos here. There's even Duplo, the Disney version where you can get Mickey and Minnie Mouse. Here's a close up of the Razor Crest. There's ATAT. There's Ahsoka Tano, Fighting Dark Maul. Here's Spider Man Sanctum Workshop. You can see Doctor Strange right there. Morbius vs. Miles Morales. And King Namor's Throne from Wakanda Forever. Over on the graphic novel section, there's Scarlet Witch, Silk, 
Captain America, Ant-Man, Black Widow, and Spider-Man. Over on the other side, there's a lot of graphic novel in this section. Ooh, I see Bone. Have you read this? Over on this side, there's more graphic novel. There's I Hate Fairyland. There's Americana. Here's some Harry Potter items. There's even the Lego Harry Potter books. Once you open the book, there's a playset inside. It's a potion class, kind of similar to Polly Pocket. Look at all these cool card games. There's Marvel Dice Throne. There's Space Mountain. Space Mountain has a game. There's Food Fight. Look at this. It looks, this looks fun. There's Marvel Champions. Even Disney Mr. Toad's Wildest Adventure has a board game too. Here in the bargain section, there are these My Busy Book. If you are familiar with them, there's the Minion, the Disney Princesses. They come with figurines where your child can take that figure and play along as the story progresses. I also want to show you the science fiction section. There's Halo, there's Star Wars, there's Warcraft, there's even Stranger Things books, and Star Trek, of course. For all you dice rolling and tabletop fans, here's a D&D section. With the increase of popularity, it's nice to see that they're readily available. But still remember to visit your local board game and card shop as well. Oh look, it's a friend's notebook. Over on the fantasy section, I see Magic the Gathering, War of the Spark Forsaken. I see Dragon Republic, The Witcher. The Cradle of Ice. Here's some more graphic novels. Are you a Studio Ghibli fan? There's Jigsaw Puzzle, Hand Towel, and even Totoro with an umbrella. Hey, where's his leaf? Here's some cool Gundam figurines. Are you a Gundam fan? Go ahead and comment below Studio Ghibli or Gundam. If you're a manga fan, look at all these books. They have a lot here. They even have mini backpacks here. There's Hogsworth back there. There's the TV Friends series. And there's even My Hero Academia. And there's even more bargain books right here. You can get all these amazing comic books on sale. Well, I hope you enjoy our journey with us at Barnes & Noble. Once again, I'm Yummy Gummy with my dog Noodle. Thank you so much for going on this exploration with us and watching till the end of this video. For more pop culture content, or if you just like Nudo, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button and the little bell icon. With so many more places to explore, we'll see you on the next Sweet Finds. Bye!